Hi, I'm Rod, K8RR from DX Engineering with Wolfgang from uh, Loop Antenna, Sarah Mazzoni. And uh, we're going to talk about some of their products here at Hamvention 2024. How are you doing, Wolfgang? Okay, hi. Um, so, of course, uh, one of the mainstays at uh, Loop Antenna is the Baby Loop yeah. um, that uh, works on 40 through 10. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, that's a great antenna for a lot of people who yeah, have yeah. Uh, space constraints, uh, yeah. HOA. And uh, people are astonished. After they bought it, they are even more astonished what the, uh, what the antenna is able to do. Yeah? It does a lot you of... Can, you can easily compare that with a dipole, even better. Yeah? Because right. Because when you have a 40 meter dipole, try to turn it. Yeah. You can't turn it, you and can. this one is a little bit directional, so you yeah, can turn yeah, it with uh, a rotator when you mount it. Towards the gamma mesh, yeah, it has a 60B gain compared to the backside. Yeah, that that is the direction. This way. Yeah, there are some some hams uh, believing that the uh, that the uh, direction is to the side, but no, it's, it's not. along. It's like a wheel. Yeah, yeah in the, in the line with the gamma mesh. Exactly. And uh, this is a uh, a fully tunable antenna yeah. with its uh, master controller. You are not limited to the bands. Yeah? Sure. If you are um, a radio listener on shortwave also, mm -hmm. many people start with listening shortwave right. broadcasts. Yeah? You can use it as well. Yeah? And because it's a loop, it's low noise. Yeah, yeah. It yeah. works differently it's than a, other exactly. antennas. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, you don't need to, to put it on a tower. Uh, the opposite is right. Yeah, They are not happy on a tower. No. It has to sit close to the ground. Optimum is uh, 1 meter 50 equals 5 feet, between 5 and 7 feet. You have to find out. Right. Yeah, but um, so it's easier to, to have access to the antenna. And uh, yeah, so we always recommend a, 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 a rotator for that. Right, so that you yeah. can take advantage of its directivity. E exactly. And uh, the uh, height above ground for the baby. Uh, between five and say yeah. eight feet is uh, going to be determined by how good your ground yeah, is. Yeah, yeah. What about for the somebody? The thumb is about uh, twice the diameter. Between there it is. One and a half and twice the diameter sure. of the antenna. Um, and what about the folks that can use it on the balcony of an apartment building? You or can something? use it on a balcony. However, when it's uh, made from wood, uh, yeah, we would recommend to have something, uh, some iron <laughs> on the on the ground. Metal, Not bigger than metal one square meter. Screen. Oh. Yeah, 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 and and the uh, the heart of the baby loop and uh, and the midi, which is the larger model yeah. uh, that uh, covers eighty through ten, and, and the, the stealth, stealth loop, yeah. which is a portable uh, forty through ten lower power model. Mm -hmm. um, the heart of uh, these uh, loop antennas is the uh, ATU two point zero. Yeah, yeah. uh, when I can say something to the power while you mentioned that sure. now, yeah, the baby loop. Um, has a basic uh, power uh, allowance of 200 watts PEP. Okay. However, if it's not enough for you, uh, you are free to put your power amplifier behind the tuner, and then it can make between 450 up to one kilowatt, depending on the frequency. On 10 meter, you can do one kilowatt. Okay. I know people who are doing more. <laughs> sure. Yeah. Um, and the and the, uh, the, the the baby loop can handle that. The midi loop. Handles well, yeah, higher yeah. power on higher frequencies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, the stealth antenna is uh, 100 watts. Ah, even a little more, 120, 125 watts. Yeah. Okay, and the beauty of the stealth is that you can get it out of your car and put it on yeah. top of the car. Put it on the roof of your car, right? because it needs it needs to sit on the ground, or it needs to sit on a reflective uh, surface. Right. And your car's roof is the best. <laughs> um, and, and if you're going to be on a picnic bench, uh, bring, yeah, sure. bring a piece of screen or sheet people, metal yeah. and put it underneath the yeah. stealth. The stealth has adjustable feet to adjust the SWR yeah, exactly. uh, to get it uh, uh, yeah, dialed yeah. in. They are rubber feet, they won't crash your, your car. Yeah. Oh, perfect, yeah, right? Yeah, sure. So all of these loop antennas are run by the ATU 2.0. Yeah. Uh, and and the, uh, the beauty of uh, this unit is that it sends a signal out to each of the antennas. At, like an analyzer, and then and then it yeah. tells the uh, loop motor where to go to yeah. get the right tuning and for the frequency. And it's incredibly fast. If you make a QSY from the 40 meter to 10 meter band, it's done in 10 seconds. Wow, yeah. that is pretty quick. And when you stay within a band and you are just moving within a band, yeah, 
it's a question of one or less one second. Yeah, it's incredibly fast. That's great. And when you think what's happening during the tuning, yeah, pulsing the, uh, the signal to the antenna, measuring the SWR, and then adjusting with the motor, and right. that continuously in less than a second, you have to find another item like that. <laughs> That's fantastic. The ATU 2.0 interfaces with just about any modern radio with the uh, accessory cables yeah, that are available. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I didn't and uh, one, of, one of the other accessories that's available for this uh, yeah. tuning unit, yeah, yeah. it's a, a, exactly. a controller as a, a wireless, a wireless. Uh, keypad, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, because the, uh, the ATU comes with the wired keypad. Yeah, and, and, we, and, con and we continue to, um, to uh, sell it with, uh, with a wire because right. of the reason when the, when the battery is empty after some months, and right. usually it is when Right you when you need it. <laughs> <laughs> when you need it. Right when you take it out. So this is a new accessory. Yeah. Uh, the uh, the uh, USB wireless keypad. Exactly. That plugs into the USB in yeah, the front yeah, the of the receiver, unit. Yeah, the receiver. You know, the it's it's hardly bigger than a USB uh, plug. Yeah. Yeah. There's the receiver. Right. Put it in, and it's plug and play. Works immediately. Yeah. There's nothing to be adjusted. Also. So for each one of these loop antennas that runs off the uh, the ATU 2.0. It comes with its 24 volt uh, yeah. a power supply yes. that plugs into the AC. The reason mains. are the motors. We are always using 24 volt DC motors. And so, because of that, there was a limitation on portable operation. Exactly. Great new product from yeah. Loop Antenna. Sierra Mazzoni has the uh, up converter. And we're just bringing, uh, you're just bringing that out, and uh, you're getting ready to send those to yeah, the XN. We have it here for the first time. Yeah, it's uh, on the market a few days yeah. only. <laughs> and uh, the idea came from the Pota people. Yeah, they take the stealth loop uh, to the park. Right. Yeah, and they they are carrying, and we are not getting younger. Yeah, they are carrying heavy car batteries and uh, put them in a line, then to have 24 volt. Right. Two 12 volt car batteries to run the ATU, so yeah. that they can use the portable. Yeah, yeah, so there's a great solution. That, you, you use your your lighter in the car, yeah, 12 volt. Right. Uh, it makes 24 volt, and usually when you buy the the cheap stuff on on the internet, it's so noisy that our slogan for the uh, stealth loop, no noise, no limit, is obsolete. So that's why retain that no noise, no noise, no, no limits, limits with yeah. the Italian built loop antenna yeah. up converter yeah. that takes your 12 to 13, 14 volts yeah, in, yeah, your, it's in not, your vehicle not mm. up to mm. the 24 volts required yeah. by the yeah, uh, tuner. Yeah. And it comes with a cable that you need, Both either to the, to the lighter of your car, or right. you have a, another battery somewhere, 12 volt is sufficient, and then the uh, necessary cable to feed into the ATU. So, this is a great uh, new product. Uh, it's uh, made by Sierra Mozzoni yeah, in yeah. Italy. It's exactly. And it's quiet. Yeah, it's There's absolutely no noise. quiet. You won't hear anything. When you switch it on, nothing. Yeah. We're uh, super happy for you to have this great new piece for uh, your uh, loop antenna line. Yeah, yeah. And thanks yes. a lot for joining me uh, <laughs> here today. It's a lot of fun to be at Hamvention once again. Uh, also for us, yeah, although it's stressful. <laughs> uh, the time shift. Yes. The time shift. It's it's a fun to be here, but um, you know there are six hours in between. <laughs> You'll get used to it by the time it's yeah, uh, time to leave and now. go back, right? The the first day is the worst. <laughs> That's right. Good to see you. Thanks okay. a lot. My pleasure. Take care, everybody.